Hi, I'm Nantaya, and this is your Today's News Brief. Zimbabwe police raid gay group offices. Police raided the offices of the Gay and HIV Awareness Group on Friday. Ellen Chadihama, 34, and Ignatius Mambi, 38, are employees of the Gay and Lesbians of Zimbabwe organization. They were arrested on allegations under Zimbabwean censorship laws on Friday. They were said to have posted a letter in their office from former San Francisco mayor, Willie Lewis Brown, criticizing the Zimbabwean president's opposition to homosexuality. Attorney David Hofisi said the two will remain in jail until Wednesday, and he was not allowed to visit them over the weekend. President Robert Mugabe has described same-sex partners as, in quote, lower than dogs and pigs, close quote, but arrests of gays are rare in Zimbabwe. Mugabe 86 has been in power for three decades since Zimbabwe gained independence from Britain. Last year, he entered a power-sharing coalition government with his long-term rival, Morgan Tisvangari, following a dispute in the 2008 elections. However, the fragile partnership has been fraught with disagreements, including allegations that Mugabe's party has not done enough to promote democratic reform. Human rights organization called for Mugabe to face trial at the International Criminal Court on charges of political violence, vote rigging, and human rights violations. Homosexuality is illegal in most African countries. Last week in Malawi, a judge sentenced a gay couple to the maximum 14 years imprisonment with hard labor after the men celebrated their engagement with a party at a hotel. In Uganda, lawmakers are considering a bill under which homosexuals could be sentenced to life imprisonment and repeat offenders could be executed. Even in South Africa, the only African country that recognizes gay rights, gangs have raped lesbians. I'm Nantaya, and as always, thank you for watching.